All right, 6.5 guys, I'm sure this looks familiar to you. We've got the uh, fuel filter manager here. Uh, it's outside of the truck. So we've got the inlet right there in 3 eighths, and then we've got the outlet and the drain right there in quarter. Fuel heater on the bottom here, and then a sensor for um, water and the fuel off to the side there. So uh, we're going to relocate that so that it's out of that valley. We can service it a little bit better and get rid of this uh, fuel heater with this guy. So we've got a nice little water drain here, uh, two ins, two outs. We're going to plug up one of them and then use those hose barbs to, to take and uh, plumb up the uh, fuel lines. And then should we want to take and add a heater again someday, it's got a nice little spot on top where we can add that. So we're going to replumb this, mount it on the firewall where we can access it a little bit better and we'll let you know how it goes. All right, y'all, so here it is installed on the truck. Um, <clears throat> basically, you've got your uh, inlet coming in at 3 8 there on the back. Um, and then this is an outlet on the front of the filter, and so is, so is this one over here. So uh, the one on the right goes towards the injection pump, and goes right down into there. Uh, the one on the left you can either plug up or you can send it to your fuel drain. It's normally located right there. We've taken it off and just created a little loop or you can plug it whichever you want. Um, so but this allows us to, to have a little drain over yonder so that we can take and, and uh, drain off the air uh, a little easier. So there you go.